Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to interface stepper motor to AVR microcontroller. So uh, here we are using Atmega 16 AVR microcontroller to interface a stepper motor. What is a stepper motor? So a stepper motor is a brushless DC motor that divides the full rotation angle of 360 degree into a number of equal sequence or steps. Uh, the motor is rotated by applying a certain sequence of a control signal. Uh, the st uh, speed of rotation can be changed by changing the rate at which control signals are applied. Uh, here, uh, a microcontroller can be used to apply different control signals to motor uh, to make it rotate uh, according the need of applications. So first, we will see the parameters of a uh, stepper motor. First is a step angle. So what is a step angle? So a step angle is an angle in which the rotor moves when one plus is uh, uh, pulse is applied as an input to uh, input of stator this is uh, used to determine the position of stepper motor next step per revolution what is step per revolution so this is a number of step angles required for a complete revolution so the formula is 360 divided by a uh, step angle then step per second this parameter is used to measure a number of steps covered in each second and rpm that is a revolution per minute so um, it measures the frequency of rotation and by this parameter we can uh, measure the number of rotation in one minute so the relationship between this is step uh, steps per second is equals to rpm that is rotation uh, revolution per minute into steps per uh, revolution divided by 60 for uh, per second and then a uh, unipolar uh, stepper motor works in three different modes uh, first mode is wave drive modes so in this mode uh, one coil is energized at a time there are four coils so here one coil is energized at a time and all four uh, coils energize one after another so this is the uh, rotor and uh, this other uh, windings uh, we can uh, here we can give the name a b c d or sometimes it is a a dash b b dash okay so here first uh, in uh, step one uh, when uh, winding one or a will energize then in step two uh, winding b uh, then in step three c and in step four uh, d so next is a full drive mode so in this mode two coils are energized at the same time so uh, this mode uh, produce more torque power consumption is high so this is a full is a steps uh, to we can say that two phase on uh, step uh, modes so here at a time two uh, coils are energized so here i am i have given the name a b and a dash b dash so first uh, at first uh, step the a b energized so a b will be b is one and other two are zero then in next angle b and a dash so b and a a dash are one other two rest to r0 then uh, the next third step for third step a dash b dash uh, is energized uh, a dash b dash these two coils are energized and then after the last step uh, b dash and a so this is a and b dash gets energized uh, rest to r0 uh, then next one is half drive modes so in this uh, mode one and two are uh, energized alternatively that means at first one coil is energized and then in next step two coils are energized so this is nothing but a combination of wave and full drive mode and it is uh, it is increases the angular rotation of the motor so these are the uh, steps uh, first in first step one coil is energized other all are zero then uh, in next step two coils energized a and b then in three uh, b energized then in four uh, b and c energized then uh, next step c energized then c and d energized then uh, d energized and then uh, last step d a and d gets energized so it is a, a combination of uh, wave and uh, full wave drive now here uh, this is the circuit uh, diagram to interface the stepper motor to 
at mega 16 so here we are using unipolar motor which is having six wires with at mega 16 microcontroller only four wires are required to control the stepper motor so what about rest so this two uh, common wires of this stepper motor connected to the power supply uh, these two wires uh, are commonly connected to power supply and uh, U, uh, uln this ic uln or uh, l2 93d this are the driver ic used to drive the stepper motor so this other driver ic uh, which is having a six, uh, 500 to 600 milliampere current so here which is uh, which is used to drive the stepper motor this two ic we can use uln 2003 or l293d so i have used uh, l293d to drive this stepper motor now uh, we are writing the program to rotate it in a clockwise direction so this hash include avr oblique uh, io.h that is a standard input output header file of avr next uh, is a standard header file for delay then void main void main program stats then port b used as a output port so here port uh, ddrb that is data direction register which is used to configure the port as input or output so we have used uh, the port b is equals to 0x 0f that means uh, the upper bits 0 to 4 are used uh, 0 to 3 0 1 2 3 this uh, four pins are used as output pins then while one forever loop or continuous loop first step for first step the see this uh, all are we are not using this per four pins only we are using from zero to three pins of port b this is port b so uh, this will be zero only uh, convert this uh, we are converting to hex number zero x represent hex number so zero this will be zero and this will be one one zero zero so this will be convert this number to hex it will be c so here port b will be c then call delay uh, 100 thousand millisecond that means one second delay then port b is equals to next value is zero one 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 so here zero one one zero so this will be a uh, six zero x zero six then next call delay and then again uh, the value will be zero next value is uh, zero zero one one so this will be zero x zero three then call delay then last value is one zero zero one so it will become zero x zero nine call delay and end of the main program so uh, you this is for clockwise uh, direction you can generate for anti clockwise direction by just uh, reversing the order of these numbers or steps uh, it will be start from this will be first uh, second third and fourth to uh, rotate it in anti clockwise direction so first step um, hash include that is a standard header file input output header file then a delay header file main program uh, ddrb is equals to 0x 0f that means port b act as an output port then while one forever loop port b is equals to 0x first values uh, will be last step four that is nine then call delay then uh, 0x 03 then pass the value 0x 06 then call delay then pass the value 0x 0c and then call the delay so this is the uh, for anti-clockwise direction hope you have understood uh, how to write the code now uh, we, uh, i have using uh, micro c pro uh, for avr to write the code and to generate the hex file so this is my code uh, void main uh, ddrb is equal to 0x0f continuous loop and this is the code for uh, clockwise direction i have just copied it from here and uh, you can see my previous video how to write the code in micro c pro for avr and how to generate the hex file then uh, how to how to design the uh, circuit in proteus software and how to load the hex file so i have already written the code then uh, save this uh, file and uh, build it generate the hex file then design uh, this whole circuit in proteus software you can watch my uh, previous uh, videos how to design this 
uh, circuits so here first i have used an atmega 16 microcontroller then l293d that is driver ic and then motor st stepper motor so here a uh, six wire stepper motor is used and see port b is uh, using as output port so here port b is uh, connected to this uh, input of l293d in1 then in2 then in3 and in Four, okay next this two uh, enable one enable two these two are commonly connected to power supply then vss is also connected to power supply ground is connected to ground then output of this uh, l293d is connected to uh, motor so out one out two out three and out four are connected to motor and then uh, the middle middle two terminals of um, this motor are connected to commonly connected to power supply so this is the connection and uh, here vs is connected to power supply and uh, just double click on this and uh, load the hex file i have already loaded this hex uh, my hex file is stepper motor hex file load the hex file run this simulation uh, see here it is rotating from 0 then 90 degree then 180 degree then 270 degree then 360 then again it will be from 0 90 180 so this is a clockwise direction program hope you have understood how to interface stepper motor to avr microcontroller atomega 16 microcontroller